Hello guys in this video we'll tell you how to face when memory integrity is off in Windows 10 or 11. But before we start the video guys if you have any computer or software related problems please feel free to contact us by visiting our website and using the submit a problem button from there. And comment down below on our videos about your problem and don't worry we'll make a video for you to resolve it. Number 1. Check your hardware compatibility. Start by ensuring that your hardware components are compatible with memory integrity. Number 2. Update your graphic drivers. For this, press the window key plus R to open the run box. Then in the run box, type devmgmt.msc and click OK to open the device manager. Then in the device manager window, just expand the display adapter section. It will list all the graphic drivers installed on your system. Then do the following for all of the drivers. Like right click on display driver and choose uninstall driver. And from there make sure to uncheck the delete the driver software for this device option in the pop up if it shows up. After that go to the top menu in device manager and under the actions tab select scan for hardware changes. The driver should appear back in the list. If it does not, don't worry. Just simply restart your PC and it will appear back. And then right click on display driver again and choose update driver then from there select search automatically for driver window will automatically scan for available driver updates and will download them after this just simply restart your pc to apply the changes if it didn't work again right click on display driver and choose update driver but this time select browse my computer for drivers off then from there select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer after this, select the drive you want to install. Generally, it is a pre-selected top option in the list and click next. After this, just simply again restart your PC to apply the changes. If even that doesn't work, you can try going to your laptop or graphic card manufacturer's official website and downloading the latest driver for a specific model from there. And then simply install the drivers and again restart your PC. Number 3. Update System Drivers For this, navigate to the settings menu and from there select windows update after this go to advanced settings and click on optional updates option then select the driver update if one is available and select download and install from the drop down menu number four check bios like uefi settings for this visit your motherboard manufacturer's website and download the latest bios like uefi update for a specific model and follow the manufacturer's instructions to update your BIOS like UEFI. But be cautious during this process, as incorrect updates can potentially damage your motherboard. Number 5. Windows Update For this, press Windows plus I key to open the Windows settings. Then from there, click on Update and Security. After that, in the Update and Security window, click on Windows Update in the left hand side menu. Then from there, click on Check for Update and let Windows search for any available updates and automatically install them. After the updates are installed, just simply restart a computer to apply the changes. Number 6. Uninstall relevant app. For this, right click on the start button. Then from there, select install app from the menu. And from there, locate your third party security software in the list. Click on it and select uninstall option. Number 7. Run SFC and DISM scans. For this, search by command prompt. Right click the top result and select the run as an researcher option. Then from there, type the following commands to perform a quick fix on your PC. The command is sfc slash scan now. And be patient and wait till the scanning is complete. After this, open start, search for command prompt, right click the top result and again select the run as an researcher option. And again type the following commands to perform a quick fix on your PC. The DISM commands are used for scanning your PC and automatically installing broken or missing window files on your PC. Number 8. Reset the Windows Security App For this, open this window setting by pressing Windows plus I key. Then from there, click on Apps and then Install Apps. And from there, navigate to the computer's app list until you find a desired app. And when you locate it, click the three horizontal dots to the right of it to bring up a menu where you may choose advanced options. And from there, locate the reset section by swiping it down. 